Hey, welcome to the channel. Um, we've had a lot of questions about what we do with our chickens here on the farm. And so I thought that I would do a quick video on that and just show you all a little bit of how we work things. Historically, we have kept the chicks in the garage in brooders uh, for upwards of about four weeks and then moved them up into the chicken house. Um, this year we did things a little bit different. So we brought down one of our chicken tractors, which is right here. Um, this is a five by eight, which makes it easy to be able to get up on a trailer if we need it. Um, and I just have built this with 24 inch hardware cloth around it. I have an easy opening to be able to get to the water and the feed. And this seems to be the best chicken tractor layout that we have. This is all 26 gauge aluminum on top that we had left over from a couple of years ago when one of the wind storms blew it off the barn. And I just cut that to size. Um, we don't have wheels on this because it's only five to eight. But what we do have is two eye bolts right here. And I just have a lightweight cord. And this is uh, irrigation tubing. This is Rainbird one inch tubing that I slid on. I'm, I have a large so you, I can use both to pull. But one of the biggest things that I want to kind of express with this is a lot of people are leaving chickens in the brooder, in my opinion, a lot longer, making a lot more work. For me, we came out, we put a feeder in, we put a water in, and we just ran an extension cord out and set it right here. That's at two weeks. Uh, the chicks were two weeks old when we started doing that and they immediately started eating the grass. We didn't have any trouble at all. Um, I'm gonna walk around and show you, we have roughly 15 chickens in here. We did lose one in a moving accident, but that's only one. So as I move, you can see them coming out, uh, tanning a little bit and let them see a little bit closer. And so they're healthy. Uh, we're not having any trouble with them at all. Um, a lot of people will say, you know, what kind of marks will they make? You'll see our, our cat, Gator, loves them as well. Um, he sits out here for hours and watches. But one of the biggest things that I want to show you all is that I've had a couple of people comment they don't want the grass messed up. Okay, I just moved these 30 minutes ago, and you can see the mark in our backyard. Okay? If you look right here, this was two weeks ago. So this looked like that a week ago and now it doesn't so yeah it's in the backyard we're in the country it doesn't matter but if you're really worried about it it's not and i like it because it's going to add a lot of nutrients especially nitrogen to the yard and in about another two weeks we will move these chicks and the chicken tractor up into the pasture uh, until it's time to harvest if you have any questions leave them in the comments uh, we'll be happy to help and of course subscribe thanks a lot for listening